just the two launches today are part of a special Arts in the Community event, which has been organized by Guildhall Press and Craig and Enterprises. Uh, this is in support of the Arts Council campaign against the cuts in its budget. Uh, as Jimmy Nesbitt said, if we do it with the arts, all we're left with is the politics. The arts account for just 0.1% of the entire Stormont budget, uh, but we're now being told that that's too much. Indeed, the 13 pence a week per person is too much and that it should be less. Uh, we, of course, profoundly disagree uh, with that, as does our next guest, Mr. Connor O'Kane, aka Techno Peasant, who is now going to perform a song setting out his very articulate and typically humorous response to these cuts. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Connor O'Kane. So we is very little money. Thirteen pounds a week to keep the flame alive. Thirteen pounds a week to fan our greatest asset, our people and our stories and the spirits that rise. While it's Half a crown a week for clowns in a local circus. Half a crown a week for comedians by the stores. Half a crown a week for some new surrealist vision. I'm not talking about Stormont, cause they get less and cost us more. A thirteen pence a week Supporting local fiction Thirteen pence a week Imagining our past A thirteen pence a week Rehearsing our true feelings Without these institutions How long will our own peace last? I said thirteen pence a week for carnival and mela, half a crown a week for colours, fools and lords, a half a crown a week for a city street and music, sure a busker and my shopping mall, she'd starve by asking more. Down there, their cuts cut deep, but they're never there. And sometimes it's conservatives or you keep on saying they're both dedicated swallowers of them. And all around and up and down, you hear the shouts in London town. Well, we're all in.